this giant lobster. The giant crabs and the giant lobsters are pretty, pretty for real enemies. I'll try to sneak attack this piece of shit. Oh, it's actually three of them. Oh, all right, we might have. Uh, I thought two was gonna be some shit. This is three. Ooh. Oh, let me shoot the arrow, bro. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it! Ah, no, please, please! Oh. God damn, I didn't know they could grab attack you. Oh, oh, here comes friends, here comes friends. Bro. What you gonna do, what you gonna do? Now that I didn't like to grab you, I gotta kinda be. Alright, I really wanna. Come on, one at a time, fellas. Dude, is he in a tree? Oh my god! <laughs> fucking lobster in a tree. What is this fucking foolishness? Easy, easy. Oh, oh, pull your sword up. Come on, come on. That's right. Mm, damn. Don't grab me, don't grab me. Ah! Jesus. Oh my lord, back up, back up. Mm. I may have like severely bit off more than I can chew. No! Oh! They like hit and they back up so quick so you can't like retaliate. Alright, get back, get back, get back. Oh! What are you spitting in my face? Is that like just water? Super concentrated water? <laughs> All right, Dakota, you, you gotta get up. Oh, you missed me that time, baby. Oh, where's your friend? Where's your friend? Oh my, is that a fourth? No, we, we, we can't be fighting the whole fucking swamp. Oh my god. Please stop spitting at me. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him! Ah! Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him! Boom! Piece of shit. Oh my god. God, now we got four. Fuck it, we might as well just fight four. I mean, we've came this far. Oh, shit. Oh, you suck. Cut down a fucking generation of lobster out here. Oh! Back up, back up, back up. Whoa! What the fuck is that? Oh, how the fuck are you even involved with these lobster? This is just like a this is just like a friend of theirs. Oh my god. I wanted just like like a goofy video of fighting two or three lobster. Anybody else? Yo, 
hit, hit a pose after that. You're the man. You're the man. I don't remember who this is. Uh... Oh, big man, big man. All right, slow down, tough guy. Move kind of quick. Yeah, you don't like that counter attack, do you? That's another beautiful thing about the shield. That counter attack is so nasty. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is that? The sun? Yeah, like you let them hit, and then boom! What oh, missed that time? Yeah, once they bang on the shield, you can just follow them up with that quick, like uppercut. I don't. Oh, he's like leaping fire everywhere. Yeah, like, I'll let him tag me just to, like, show you. Oh, he made me play for it right there. Come on. Oh, man, all right. Like, I'm trying to do it now. Like, you can't try to force it. Now, now I'm just fucking up. Boom! Walk into that, pussy. Oh. Jesus, this big dude is stunting on me. Out of here with that. What are you trying to like flex on me for? Nah. Oh man, this is a Radagon's wolf. Ah, it, it kills me to put down a wolf, but I gotta do it. Actually, what I should do. Ah, a little wolf on wolf action. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Get him! Get him! It's a dog fight! Get him! Let's kick him on his ass. Oh my god, he's just so fast. Oh, my boys! <laughs> Not my boys! These wolves are just standing over there, they're not even trying to fight him anymore. <laughs> they said, fuck this. Alright, let's just take this thing down. I'll help you, I'll help you. Oh my god, maybe I won't, maybe I won't. He's gonna kill me. Holy shit! Get him, guys, get him! Too fast, they can't even get a hold of him. Oh my god, he's slaughtering them. You guys got some cover fire. You survived, good job, buddy. We, we got him. <laughs> Black Knife Assassins. These are some of the meanest motherfuckers out here. Fast, very fast, very deadly. You gotta really watch your stamina. They're always moving, always block. Yep, yeah, he just broke my guard. Fuck, fuck. Buddy, buddy, buddy. And you're trapped in this fucking room with him. Calm down. Again. I can't get a minute. Can I get a minute, bro? Dude, this guy's all over me. Holy shit. Back up, you clown. <laughs> this guy get tired? 
Yeah, back up, give me some room, my guy. Mmm, yeah, saw you coming. Killing each other out. Make a move. Boom! He's still up? Holy shit. Alright. Oh, watch out for that. That's a nasty attack. That, if it even hits your shield or anything, it'll slowly drain your health. Yeah, Black Knife Assassins are nasty. Which you can actually get them as a summon. They are one of the best summons. Which I might need to start switching my summon up. I think I'm still using the wolves. That's another thing. Like, people who probably know nothing about this game, they're probably like, oh, he's fucking cheating. He just keeps sicking wolves on people and shit. But then, like, people who do know about this game, they're like, damn, why is he still using the wolves? The wolves fucking suck. The wolves are, like, one of the worst summons. Like, I think, yeah, I can go to my summons. Yeah, where are my summons at? Yeah, like I use the wolves. The wolves are the first summons that you get. Yeah, they're like by far one of the week. I just use them because like wolves are my favorite animal, and I think it's funny to like sick dogs on people and shit. But yeah, you can get like eighty different summons. Like you can have like those bloodhound knights, the red man knights, which are nasty dragon knights. Like where is it? Yeah, the black, the black knives. I think I even have. I don't know the dung eater. But yeah, like, you can get some crazy summons that, like, help you in every battle and shit. I'm just out here with, like, three random dogs. Which probably once I get to, like, Kayla to the cap, I might have switched. I'll use the dogs for as long as I can, but after a while, like, it stops being funny and, like, they really just start getting destroyed by everybody. This dude's... This dude's pretty for real. Yeah, like, you can see his sword, how he has it coated with that, like, shit. That's, uh, Deathblight. Worst status ailment in the entire game. Like, you'll see a little meter, like, down in, uh, the bottom of my screen. Deathblight, the status effect... Other status effects still have, like, bleed, frostbite. I mean, they're pretty nasty, but Deathblight, if that meter fills up all the way, you will just die immediately. Doesn't matter how much life you have, how much health, how much armor, blah, nothing. Like, you get hit with enough death blight, you will just die immediately. It is the worst status effect. And his blade is coated in it. So even if I'm blocking the hits, and, like, he's not actually hitting me, he's still going to be building it up. So you gotta be really careful about enemies like this. You could be winning the fight the whole time. He hits you enough, even on your shield, you'll go down. Pussy. We'll yeah, this is where rolling comes into effect. Ooh. Yeah, because you don't want to put that shield up and let him touch your shield at all. Mm. Clown. That's another thing with shield users that I try to... I do, like, advocate for the shield. I think the shield is, I mean, fantastic. I mean, you've seen me use it so far. It's so great to have that, like, just security and not rely just heavily on roll. But you do need to have a strong, like, roll ability. You cannot solely rely on the shield. That's a big mistake. Because you'll run into enemies like this, enemies like the Avatar that'll just blow your stamina out, and then you're fucked, like... Don't think the shield is, like, the end-all be-all. You still have to have some good roll ability. Oh! Yeah, now you'll see how it's built up, that black bar. Every time he hits me, it'll keep building up. Disappearing and shit too. Come on, pussy. All right, I'm one swing. I guarantee I got him. Boom. Yeah. So if you are gonna do shield, make sure you still like keep that rolling ability sharp. <laughs> Look at this bad motherfucker right here. Oh shit. I'll tell you what he's thinking. He's thinking I swear to come up behind me and kick my ass. Oh shit. Alright. Oh, I 
bow to you and you're gonna turn your back on me? That's shitty, dude. Come on. Oh, let's go, buddy. Let's go. I gotta fight him on this tiny ass little platform, too. Not today. Jesus. Oh my god, Dakota. Alright, buddy. Alright, buddy. God, he keeps breaking my guard. Holy fuck. Alright, let's, let's slow down a bit, bud. Ooh. Here we go with the wind. I hope your dumbass flies off the edge. See how you like this, pussy. Boom! That was all missed. Oh, come on, come on, come on! Don't go off the edge. Don't go off the edge. I guarantee it. Nah, how did you not? Bitch. Alright. Come on, buddy. Yeah, fuck you up there. Oh! 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 Oh, he blocked the last one! Holy shit! I thought I had him right there. Never gonna hit me, dude. I don't know why you keep trying. Oh, I missed! Ah! <laughs> You're not that guy, pal. Ain't gonna happen. Alright, we got our, our first boss dragon over there. Which I've seen a lot of ways you can, like, sneak around him. Like, he's sitting on a key that you need. I don't think we're gonna do that, though. I think we're also gonna try to fight him on horseback. This swamp's a little treacherous. What's up, pussy? Oh, I missed. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Fuck him up. 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 Yeah, they're together. Ooh, he pissed. What's he on about? Little dummy. Up with my horse, can't give up with my horse. Oh, rock, rock. Yo, 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 yo. Ah! Is that a fucking missile? <laughs> you gotta do shit. Oh, 
horse. Ate my horse. Get up, bro. Get up. This is Loretta, the first night of Mechala. If you didn't know anything about the lore, obviously, Mechala and Millennia are. They're the tippy top. Millennia is the greatest swordswoman ever, hardest boss in any fucking game ever made. And Mechala is kind of like the. I don't know, like the king, but he has his shit. I mean, I'm not going to go on to his lore, but. Which, this is just her spirit. Like, her actual body resides in, uh, Haley Tree, like, with, uh, Yeah, she ain't no slouch, though. God, fighting people on horseback is always a little, like, unnerving. They just have so much more mobility than you do. Yo, 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 yo! God, you always have to be a little more careful, especially me, like, around magic. My shield, it'll 100% block, like, physical. I can't block magic, though. Like, if magic hits my shield, it will still hurt me. So I gotta be, like, extra careful with people like that. Bring it on, bring it. Ooh, yeah, she got a big bow just like mine. She's a little far away, I don't know if you got to see it, but. Ooh. Oh, oh. Yeah, the knives are fucking me up. There it is. Yeah, that arrow will probably impale me. Back up, back up. Mm. Yeah, you'll run into her, like, like I said, that was just her spirit. You'll run into her actual physical body at the Haley Tree whenever we go to that area. A couple people do that. Like Godfrey, you'll run into Godfrey's spirit before you actually fight him physically. I think any character that has a strong connection to an area, they'll just leave their spirit there and have, like, two forms. I'm not really sure how it works. Uh, I'll show you guys this part just for the, the Wakazashi. I realize I never like kind of explained it to you. Like right here, boom. You'll run into stuff like this, like the chariots or like these balls, like and you can't roll through them, you can't block them, you can't do anything. But with the Wakazashi, you can use that ability, like my little blade. You can go into like a mist mode and just kind of like move imperviously through things. Boom. And you can just yeah, like disappear and reappear like that. There's a lot of parts in the game like this, like I said, the chariots, you talk to anybody, the chariots are a fucking nightmare, and these ball things, but that's why I carry the Wakazashi with me, like not only is it another badass samurai weapon, it just like makes you sort of untouchable in certain scenarios, if you can get like the timing and the ability down right. I just realized I brought that up, yeah, in part one, like why I carry my Wakazashi and my little blade like that, that's why I do it. So I can't get touched. Something up here. Oh yeah. That's, that's a pretty cool entrance. Big man. Renala of the Full Moon. She is the final boss of part two. 
Which I skipped the first half of her fight because it's like essentially just like beating up on some kids in a library. Like it's it's very on par with her oh, lore, and it makes sense for the game. Beloved. But if you don't know the game, you would be like, no why, why is Dakota beating up on these I kids in a library? <laughs> so I skipped that first half. Ye will be countless born forever and ever. Which this isn't her like getting stronger into a second form. This is actually her daughter, Ronnie, coming to her aid. Upon my name is Rani the Witch. Mother's rich Shalemba yeah, shall this is like an illusion by created by her daughter Rani, like making her seem more powerful than she is. I need to beat the game like three times to understand that. Of the last queen of Caria, Renala of the full moon. Beautiful. And the majesty of the night she conjureth. Bring it. Yo, yo, yo. I don't know any magic. Oh, you put dogs on me? Nah, bitch. I put dogs on you. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god. It's an all out dog fight. What the fuck? Get him, get him. No, 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 no. Yeah, my dogs are coming, bitch. Bite her, bite her. Guys, are you biting her over there? Bite her! Get her, get her, get her. Oh, little Ronnie. My dear I can't believe she tried to put dogs on me. <laughs> Today, uh, it's the end of part two. No deaths. Which I think, uh, I don't know if I'll do Caleb next or the Capitol next. I guess it doesn't really matter. 